Adriano. Now for me, this guy is one of the biggest what ifs in football. The Brazilian had everything. He had pace, power, strength. His technical ability was fantastic for such a big guy. The way that he'd strike the ball, honestly, it was so pure. He was known as the emperor. Milan fans adored him. But then one day, everything changed for Adriano. Adriano received a phone call, giving him the news that no human wants to hear. His father had passed, and Adriano was devastated. Zanetti said he overheard the phone call, and he heard the screams that Adriano let out. He says he can still hear it to this day. Zlatan doesn't approve of many people, but he did Adriano. To Inter, the first thing I said to the president, I demand him to stay because he's the player I want to play with. Because he, the way he was, he was an animal. He could shoot from every angle. Nobody could tackle him. Nobody could take the ball. He was a pure animal. But it lasted for a short time. And that's the unfortunate thing for Adriano. It didn't last long. And it has us thinking, what if it did? What if he managed to fulfill every bit of his potential? Unfortunately, with cases like this, when these things happen, there's no telling how someone's going to react to the loss of a father. Everybody deals with things differently. And for Adriano, his heart wasn't in it anymore. His mind was elsewhere. And when that's the case, you've got to put your happiness first. In an interview, he said he could have stayed at Inter, made lots of money. But what's the point? That didn't really interest him. And he doesn't regret his decision to this day. And that's why Adriano is one of the biggest what-ifs in football.